I do not encourage or condone the use of tobacco or cannabis products, and if you're under the age of 18, you can go ahead and get out of here right now. Alrighty, so today I'm going to be talking a little bit about why cigarettes are so hard to quit. I've got a little bit of a list right here, and I'm going to be talking to you guys a little bit about what I've got on the list. And uh, in my personal opinion, cigarettes are one of the hardest things in the world to quit. I've tried to quit before, and it was one of the hardest things I've ever done. But yeah, today I'm going to be smoking a little bit of a Dunhill International Red Cigarette, and while talking a little bit about why cigarettes are so insanely difficult to quit. Let's get it, y'all. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? Let's get this lit up. <sighs> but yeah, why are cigarettes so hard to quit? Well, the first reason for me is it's a daily routine kind of thing. When I'm at college, and I'm not staying with my parents, currently I'm staying with my parents right now, and they're very nice. They're letting me stay for the summer. I'm really enjoying it kind of thing. I'm enjoying my time with them. But when I'm in college, my first thing I do in the morning, I get up, I get ready, I shave, I go eat breakfast, and then the first thing I do after that is I smoke a cigarette. That's my routine. That's my routine every single day. And I love it. I'm a very routine-based person kind of thing. For breakfast, I eat one of three things. I either eat toast, eggs, or sausage, and I don't eat anything else, typically unless somebody else is making the food. If I'm making the food, those are the three things I'm making, and I'm not making anything else. I gotta be completely honest with y'all. I'm a very routine-based person, so it makes sense why I like a routine-based um, habit kind of thing. And uh, it's, it's really one of the hardest factors and the biggest factor, in my personal opinion, as to why cigarettes are so hard to quit is because it's a daily routine. Daily routines are some of the hardest stuff to quit. If you have a daily routine of having a glass of alcohol before bed, that's gonna be really difficult to cut out, especially if you've been doing it for years like I have. Um, another reason that kind of goes along with the whole daily routine thing is friends. Friends you make through smoking and friends that are also smokers. Um, obviously, I'm talking to you guys right now. I'm assuming you guys uh, mostly smoke and I'm sure a lot of you guys have friends that smoke as well. Um, smokers, we tend to have friends that are also smokers kind of thing. When I'm at work, um, or when I was working at a place that had a lot of smokers kind of thing, I'd go out for smoke break and have a smoke with my coworkers kind of thing. We kind of had a friend group going where we'd go out and smoke kind of thing. And even the people who didn't smoke, who just said they would smoke for the break kind of thing, they would come out and I was friends with them too. Um, and it was one of those things where I'm just kind of looking at it like, man, this would suck if I quit because I wouldn't lose the friend group, don't get me wrong, but I would miss out on those experiences with the friend group kind of thing of just chatting and having a little bit of a quick sig for 15 minutes before I go back inside um, and get off my break and go back to work kind of thing. I would miss out on that. I would miss out on the break. I would miss out on those uh, experiences with the friends. And, and granted, I'm, I'm sure I could get friends that don't smoke. But it's one of those things where it's so much fun to smoke with friends and to just chill kind of thing. It's so nice and it becomes part of your daily routine as well, which is another reason why it's so hard to quit, of course. Another reason for me is stress. Stress is a massive factor. Cigarettes release a reward factor in your brain. They release serotonin and uh, they make you feel good. They make you feel a little bit less stressed. When you don't have a cigarette, you feel more stressed. What a surprise kind of thing. I think everybody, I think everybody here knows that kind of thing. Cigar not having cigarettes make you more stressed. Um, and the lack of nicotine causes the stress kind of thing. Um, and when you don't have that, when you don't have a cigarette, you're so much more stressed out. I will be the first one to admit, if I'm driving and I haven't had a cigarette and somebody cuts in front of me and slams on the brakes, I get a little bit irritated. I get a little bit irritated. I don't like to be irritated. It's one of my least favorite things to do. I try to be happy all the time. I try to be, stay not irritated all the time. As a kid, I, I, I was always irritated kind of thing. I was always irritated. But when I started smoking cigarettes and, well, other stuff, I'm not going to talk about that in this, this video. But when I started smoking cigarettes, um, I was so much less stressed out. Um, and it really helped me um, kind of manage the, um, not really anger. I, I never really get super angry, but I just get irritated. I get irritable. I'm just like, eh, meh, 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 I hate that person kind of thing. I, and I try not to be like that anymore. Um, but when I have an Asada cigarette, I kind of have to catch myself. I kind of have to be like, okay, don't get irritated, Jacob. Uh, you haven't had a cigarette left. Let's just keep driving and uh, pull off at the next exit and have a, and have a cigarette so I can... So I can de-stress kind of thing. It's, it's one of those things where not having a cigarette causes a lot of stress for me. And that's another reason why it's so hard to quit because not having that nicotine, not having that stress relief um, when you're stressed out, especially, and you've already been smoking kind of thing. It's, it's one of those things where if I'm gonna quit cigarettes, I wanna go to a cabin in the woods where I've got nothing and I've just gotta cook and I've got nothing to stress me out. That's what I'm trying to do. I'm not trying to quit when I'm trying, still trying to work. I'm trying to get like a cabin for a week at an, or an Airbnb or something and quit there kind of thing. That's what I'm trying to do because I think that would make it the easiest thing for me. <sighs> and 
and I gotta be completely honest with y'all, this Dunhill is absolutely fantastic. I really am enjoying it, I gotta be completely honest with y'all. But another reason is, well, it's pretty simple. The physical dependency. Unlike um, herb and stuff, and walkie slush and herb and, and stuff like that kind of thing, the, the stuff that's not, that's not legal in my state, but it's legal in Canada, you know what I'm saying? You guys know what I'm talking about. I'm not gonna say it in this video because that'll get this video demonetized, but that sort of stuff, it's not a physical dependency, it's a mental dependency. The mental dependency is the stuff I've just talked about. It's the daily routine, it's the stress. That's kind of a mental dependency. But the physical dependency is migraines and not feeling like yourself. I don't feel like myself until I've had a cigarette kind of thing. And I've actually made a whole video about not feeling like myself um, until I've had a cigarette, which is one of the worst things I, I really hate kind of thing about smoking. I wish I could feel like myself without having to smoke kind of thing, but I don't feel like myself until I've had a cigarette. I feel kind of off. I feel kind of not like myself, uh, as I just said, kind of thing. Um, so it's one of the things where it's just kind of like when I tried to quit, I didn't feel like myself. I felt like a completely different person. I, I felt like, yeah, I was still Jacob Jones, Jacob F. and Jones. Um, but I felt like a completely different version of Jacob F. and Jones kind of thing. I didn't feel like myself anymore, which sucks. I wish I could be myself without having to smoke, but to me right now as a smoker and as somebody who is smoking currently, it's, it's one of those things where right now I feel like I had to be myself to be the version of me I am right now. I have to smoke, which obviously isn't true, but that's just how it is. And of course the other physical dependencies are migraines, headaches. Um, uh, if, if people have said that their back starts hurting if they start quitting, they have aches, they have soreness, all of the above kind of thing. It's a very physical dependency kind of thing. And, and those are really the reasons why it's so hard to quit cigarettes in my personal opinion. The major reason, the major reason in my personal opinion, the, the most, the, the reason for me at least, why it's so hard to quit cigarettes is the daily routine. It's the daily routine and it's the friends that I have that smoke cigarettes too. Um, I love the daily routine. As I said, I'm a very routine-based person. I eat the same thing for breakfast every single day. I eat the same thing for lunch. I eat the, I'll switch it up for dinner. I'll switch it up for dinner. If my girlfriend wants to make something uh, that I've never had before, I'll try it kind of thing. But for lunch, uh, typically, I, I had a spurt uh, earlier, like last semester kind of thing, because I'm still in college. Uh, I had a spurt like, uh, earlier last semester where I literally, for two weeks on end, every single day for lunch, I ate fried rice with eggs and soy sauce. Every single day for two weeks for lunch. That's what I had. If that doesn't tell you guys that I'm, a, uh, I'm kind of a routine-based person, I didn't get sick of it either. The only reason I stopped making it was because, well, I just want, um, well, I guess I did get sick of it towards the end, but for that entire like week and a half before I got sick of it kind of thing, I was just like, oh my God, this stuff is gas. This stuff is fire. But it was just one of those things where I'm such a routine-based person and my routine of having a cigarette every single morning is what would really hurt. That's what I would miss the most about not smoking cigarettes anymore is missing out on that routine, missing out on that enjoyment of having a cigarette first thing in the morning and the routine of having an enjoyable cigarette every single morning and just being able to chill and relax kind of thing. And that's another factor in my opinion as to why cigarettes are so hard to quit is the relaxation kind of thing. Of course, I just talk, I talked about stress in this video and stress related to cigarettes, but the relaxation you get from cigarettes kind of thing, the just chill factor right now, I feel so relaxed right now. I feel amazing right now. I feel absolutely fantastic. I love it. I love smoking cigarettes because I it just gives me 15 minutes of peace every single day. And I, I think I've made a video about that too. I can't really remember. But cigarettes for me are my 15 minutes of peace every single day. And I love it. I love smoking cigarettes because that 15 minutes of peace is my my one thing in the single in every day where I can just sit down, put off my phone, and I just chill. I don't have to stress about anything except for smoking and lighting a cigarette. That's all I gotta do. But um, yeah, that's pretty much my personal opinion as to why cigarettes are so hard to quit. Cigarettes are insanely hard to quit in my personal opinion. I know it, there's also genetic dependence. There's also genetic predispositions. For some people, it's extremely easy to quit. And for some people, you, it's extremely hard to quit. Um, some people, they can smoke whenever they want and quit whenever they want. I wish I was like that. I'm not though. I have that genetic predisposition that says uh, you, can, you can't do that kind of thing. It sucks. It really does. But it's it's what it is kind of thing. That's my genetics. It, what, it's what it is. But uh, yeah, comment down below what you guys are think about my list, what you guys, uh, why, why are the reasons you guys think that cigarettes are so hard to quit? Let me know in the comments down below. I always encourage you guys pointing out new things to me. And uh, yeah, I think I'm going to go ahead and smoke the rest of the cigarette, chill for a minute with y'all and uh, enjoy the rest of the day. You know what I'm saying? I've just been chilling, just enjoying the day. I'm sitting at a public park right now. It's beautiful. It's about 65 degrees and uh, it's a great day. You know what I'm saying? <sighs> Man, these Dunhills, are absolutely, absolutely fantastic. I gotta be completely honest with y'all. These Dunhills have been absolutely, absolutely fantastic. And I really have been enjoying them. These Dunhills 
are so good. I see why Hunter Thompson was smoking them. I might make a video about that too, about why Hunter Smo Thompson smoked downhills. I've got my personal opinion, but I could not find anything. I did some research on why Hunter Thompson smoked cigarettes uh, or smoked downhills, and I could not find anything about why he smoked downhills. But yeah, let's go ahead and finish off the Siggy, and let's go ahead and finish off the video. Let's get it, y'all. <sighs> man, 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 this is so good. But yeah, that's the cigarette mainly. Uh, it's got a little bit really rough on that last hit, so I think I'm just going to end it here. Thank you very much for watching this video, guys. If you guys enjoyed this video, make sure to like and subscribe for more content. I have my Instagram, my book, uh, my merch, everything in the description below. Highly recommend you guys check all those out. But yeah, until the next one, guys, stay safe and peace. Have a great one out there, and stay safe, yo. You know what I'm saying? And as said, make sure to comment down below why you guys think nicotine and cigarettes as a whole are so hard to quit. But yeah, as said, until the next one, guys, stay safe and peace. Have a great one, and stay safe, yo.